Kona sana. Two of those injured are said to be in critical condition following the 10.30 a.m. accident involving two Nissan Matatas. One vehicle was headed to Meru and the other was en route to Nairobi when the accident happened. Embo County Commissioner Galgalo Hindi has called on motorists to exercise caution as the festive season beckons. We want them to be very, to be very extra careful and we want also to urge our uh, traffic police officers to uh, take keen interest on, 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 on the traffic rules so that they are implemented to the latter. <laughs> Elsewhere, a form to student in Vihiga escaped unharmed in a suspected assault attack. Recounting the incident, the Engedi Secondary School teenager said two armed men walked into their house and confronted him, but he escaped. They later touched the house. In Nakuru, more than 300 women sensitized individuals on the need to eliminate violence against women while observing 16 days of gender activism. The women decried the killing of a teenage girl by a 17-year-old boy after she declined his sexual advances. Lazima tushikane mkono wote, hata viongozi wa kisiasa, kiongozi wa kijami, pia hata mashirika ya dini, religious leaders, we need to come together and join hands. Separately, over 200 members of Losuk Group Ranch in Samburu Central are set to own land individually after the government initiated and sponsored the subdivision process. The members will subsequently be issued with a title deed soon after the demarcation exercise. Mzo wapata yeka 57.5. So kila mutu atulie na utapata shamba yako. In Mombasa, communities living in the area are keen to forge unity and strong bonds by way of their diverse cultural festivals. This idea is informed by the need to fight all forms of violence resulting from ethnic incitements which previously gave rise to deadly conflicts. Badala ya nyumba kumi, tutakuwa kila nyumba katika ya zile kumi, kuna, kuna chairman, secretary, katika hao kumi wakiwa nakawa wanakawa pamoja. And Kajedo County government is moving in earnest to adopt austerity measures in government operations in a bid to save the resources generated by the devolved unit. Kajedo Governor Joseph Olelenko has banned county officials' retreat and meetings in exotic hotels which cost the county government millions of shillings in allowances annually. Even for my cabinet and the chief officers coming here, the first day people are saying, oh, I want to book to go and sleep in town, I can't share a room. But we have found um, that really uh, it's very easy, it's very relaxing, it's bonding. And it gives us a sense of unity and a sense of oneness, which is basically what I wanted to achieve. Finally, government spokesperson Cyrus Oguna has urged long-distance truck drivers and their owners to stop their weekly protests. Oguna says the government will not reverse the compulsory use of the standard gauge railway to transport cargo. Palanzima la huduma imeboreshwa. Ni kwamba zile mianya za kukwepo shuru zimekatizwa. Kwa hivyo... Makashe nyewe wanaona tukwamba hamuna kazi tena ya kuibia mwananchi wa kawaida. Wanajifunga wenyewe. Irene Mchuma Udim, Channel 1.